Hello, Happy Dog Farm here. Um, May 30th, neighbor Al. Um, I put out my IPM Ferrocon traps from Tracy. I don't know. Tracy Incorporated. I'm looking at one right now. And one thing that kind of annoyed me about what them is trying to see inside the trap after you've closed, you know, you set it up the way they tell you to set it up. And that's why, well, that's backwards. I'll fix that. Um, you, you want, I, I did something. So I'm going to share it with you, and probably you all knew it already, but I don't have anyone to show me these tricks, so I'll show you my trick. So hang on. Okay. Okay, here's my trick. Cord stops. Now, I paid too much for these because I went into a sewing store. Um, if I were you, I'd just shop online, and next time you go to the eBay or something, get yourself a dozen or so of these things. Anyway, on the traps... You know, they give you these little side spreaders that I presume are to set it just so. So that's where they want it. And they tell you to fold up the legs underneath. Well, great. So you're trying to get inside of it and it's a hot, sticky mess. Hate that. Al's trick is you put the little stop things on the bottom so you can slide them down, get an easy look inside, and then when you're done, slide it back up. He's sliding it up, folks. Slide it back up. Slide the stopper doers up. And call it a day. Now, if you don't have these things in direct sunlight, I don't see any reason why the stopper doer shouldn't last a few seasons. Those are clear plastic bought at a sewing store. I go and get the real ones from a camping supply store like Camp Moore or REI or someplace that are probably far more rugged. But anyway, um, that's my IPM trick for the day. Um, get yourself, I'm going to fix these guys. Those leads straighten out really well, you know, and then you just slide the little stopper doers on it. And what do they call them? They call them cord stops for drawstrings on garments and bags. So you probably want the camping version. I got the clear ones because I want to see how badly that spring rusts. I think the camping version are probably stainless or inhibited steel, so they'd last longer. Anyway, do yourself a favor. It makes it a lot easier to inspect the trap. Uh, by the way, the Oriental Fruit Moth, they're here. By the way, I think I had my magic moment for um, coddling moth. So I'm going to start counting degree days, but the dye pal with surround is going out as soon as the next two rainy days go by. I really don't feel like wasting my effort on the rain. All right, that's it from Happy Dog Farm. Toodles.